Komatsu excavator, it doesn't have any grease fittings on it. And I always liked that it didn't have grease fittings because that was a lot less labor. Now, it doesn't have no grease fittings. It has, it has some right here in the bucket. And it's got a couple right there, which grease something back in the machine. Now, I always liked that it didn't have the grease fittings because it was less work. But lately, it's been screeching so much that one motion that the thing is I can't even stand running it now I've added a few grease fittings in the past to this thing I added some right here on that same motion on the boom so there's two of them there and I added one and I added one here on this thing there it is in there. And I added one right here. But I gotta add some more on this cylinder. So I've actually tried doing this once before and I wasn't able to. So what I'm gonna do different this time, I wasn't able to drill through it. So what I'm gonna do this time, I'm gonna take the cylinder off and, and drill it with a drill press. I think that'll be easier. All right, so let's get started. So before taking this completely off, you should mark on it where the grease fittings should go and try to put them where they're not going to get smashed and where they are, where you can get to them. I kind of want to put this one right here, but it's got that weird thing on it. I'm going to put this one right here. I'm going to cut this thing off, whatever that is. And this one here, I guess if I put it right there, it shouldn't get too smashed. I mean, that's the, that's the only place it can go, so. All right, so here and here. was for I mean there's a hole there but it didn't go all the way through all right so I got a grease fitting assortment here so I'm gonna go with these ones what is that okay, so here's a tap and die sets okay so this is eighth inch national pipe thread so then in this set here, I should have an eighth inch NPT tap. Here it is. Okay, you can see on there it says eighth inch NPT. 
right. Now this this set also has the tap chart of what size drill bit you have to use because that's important. So we go eighth inch NPT and it looks like we're supposed to use for a tap drill 2164s. All right. And that bushing is some hard metal. This does not want to drill through. I'm pushing pretty hard. See, it, you know, it like breaks it instead of drills it. Once you get to that bushing, it doesn't drill anymore. It's too hard.
You know, I just got this wrench. It was a cheap wrench from Tractor Supply, but I like this thing. It's got three quarter inch drive, half inch drive, hammer. You know, there's no fancy ratchet mechanism that breaks. It's just this to switch to the directions. A nice long handle and, um, and this pointy end. And this cool finish is nice too. I'll try to put the link in the description for this. And as long as all the, with all the other tools I used here. Look at that, nice and 